Hi guys, in this video, I have made a lot of progress. I did some chocolate factory things, some enchanting, I did a ton of composter upgrades, and I got a new Kara milestone, and a lot more. So make sure you guys watch till the end. Anyways, enjoy the video and subscribe. All right, so Hoppity's event is here, so I need to get more rabbits. Looks like I have two duplicates, which honestly, I'll take four new ones. I'm just kind of sad that I don't have seven rabbits, but whatever, what can you do? Now I am only two days away from my prestige to Chocolate Factory 5, and then I'll have one prestige left. That's nice, I guess I'll activate this. I'm currently saving up my chocolate for my next talisman. Actually, I think I can get it right now. Uh, let me get my thing. Oh, this is good. What's it even called? Like chocolate, smooth chocolate bar, there we go. And then CF, boom, rich chocolate chunk. Next, I just need the ganache chocolate slab. I'll do that before Chocolate Factory 5. And then these other ones I'll have to do at Chocolate Factory 5 or 6, I guess. But that's all right, I don't mind. Now I also have this unclaimed reward, let's go. Anyways, on to the farming. All right, guys, so to start off after the Chocolate Factory, I'm gonna start farming. I am currently, let's see, my, actually death. If I go to my milestones, as you guys can see, I'm only missing three milestones right now. I'm Carrot 42, which is what I'm going to mostly work on today. And then I have pumpkin and cactus left, which let me know what you guys think. I will probably end up doing cactus next because I'll probably test grind with that and then just also go for my spaceman by grinding flies. But yeah, let me get these visitors and then I'm going to start carrot farming. I'm using my spiral farm. I made a tutorial on it. If you guys are curious how it works, I can also farm it a little bit. But let me turn down the volume actually real quick. Oh my gosh. But yeah, so there's also an elite event going on right now. If you guys don't know what that is, there's a server called Elite Skyblock Farmers and there's a test event. So it doesn't actually have any like prizes, but it's a team event. So I may as well do that event a little bit. Basically just the more you farm, the better you do in the event. And I can't let my team down, even though it's a test event with no real stakes. People have been teasing me for not doing anything, but hey, I was doing foraging, you know? So yeah, I'm just going to be sitting here farming for quite a long time, probably. I will be able to get my next carrot milestone today, probably maybe two of them. I'll probably be able to finish my carrot milestone in a different episode, probably not today. But yeah, I've actually realized I need to switch some things out for farming because that's what I like to do. So first of all, what I do is I always have the correct, like, skill exp share so i'm done with forging for now so i can put my lion away and i can replace it with my pig i have all farming pets to level 100 so i just use my pig it currently has over 240 million pet xp on it but i mean better than using a non-farming pet you know and then also i need to switch out my abbey case so if i go into here where is it uh blind uh help Here it is. Switch this out, and then I get my farming one. Boom, boom, boom. There, now I get some extra farming wisdom. Because that is basically the only use we have for Abbey cases is the extra wisdom. And then back to farming carrots, I guess. Alrighty, so we have some tests to do. I use a thing where I can press a hotkey and it will just take me to a plot with test in it. And then I use my extra drops one on flies and sometimes other ones but the most important part is that i have a double damage one for earthworms because they'll just like basically teleport away if you don't do that it doesn't really matter if you use bd on the other ones it won't really make much of a difference but it's very very important when it comes to flies so make sure you guys get a bd vacuum for flies at the very least it doesn't even need to be a max one i just happen to have a max one because i've dropped multiple of the stereo things and also, there we go, we also have a sixth visitor, so I may as well do that as well. Let me just finish getting these, there we go. Oh, nice, a new nether war, I'll take it. Anyways, I just use Sky Honey, the mod, to do this, which is pretty nice. And then you can also just tap right-click once, which is really cool. I just clicked right-click once there, and then I do slash barn. And then, oh yeah, I also, my, ooh, I have a, man, this is sad. I have a billion melons, and I am out of melons. With the arachne fragments, I have so many of them. Holy, I have like over a stack of them. I put some of them in chest though. 
but I actually have enough, like, crops to max my composter speed. The only problem is I actually have to craft the enchanted golden carrots myself. And I actually have all of the materials. If I go into my sacks, I have over 400 million coins worth of enchanted carrots. But they're so annoying to craft because I'll show you guys right now what I have to do. I have to get gold blocks. I take this. I put them in the crafting table. Craft it down. Craft it into nuggets. Then I craft it into golden carrot. And I have to do that a lot. I'm not going to bore you guys with that. I might do some of that off camera. Might not even do that at all today. We'll see. Let me know if you guys want me to craft a bunch of enchanted golden carrots. I really hate it. That's why I... I'm so glad I've never gotten a carrot spaceman. This is so annoying to do. You also have to place down gold minions and stuff, but whatever, dog. I know I'll have to do it eventually, but I'm not really excited for it. Anyways, back to the farming. <laughs> I need to collect my minions. You see, a few days ago, I put some hyper catalysts in my minions. I put a stack in each of them, so I've gone through 12 per minion. And hopefully, I'm profiting in hyper catalysts aka crystal fragments, but I need to collect them because, well, they fill up very quickly. I already have two stacks of en enchanted endstone in all of them, so let me go through and collect them. Honestly, I'm just going to collect it with a silverfish. This is a lot of combat XP though, so I don't know. Hmm. Fine, okay, I'll just go through and collect the mining things and the combat things separately. Fine. Uh, I'll tell you guys how much mining and combat XP and stuff. You'll see the loot, is all I'm saying. Currently, my mining XP, I'm like, what is this? Like, 250k XP away from mining 56. And then combat, I have 86 million overflow with 100k. <laughs> 8 point, yeah. Alright guys, we have just hit mining 56 and skyblock level 208. That is actually... Huge! Oh my gosh, dude. I only have four mining levels to go. That is crazy. Oh my gosh. It may sound like not much, but I'm stranded. The last four mining levels. Oh gosh, this is going to take me a while. I'm definitely going to have to use minions. Hopefully this stack of hyper catalysts will get me a bit. I don't know how much XP will get this. I guess you guys will have to wait until later vi videos, but yeah, let me finish <laughs> getting these minions. Alright, so we have collected everything. We have about six stacks of crystal fragments. We are currently at, let's see, 200k mining XP into mining 56, so we gained like 400k XP. I have no idea how much combat XP we gained. Looks like maybe 2 million-ish, which is pretty good, honestly, for like not even two days worth of minions. Well, I guess three days worth of minions, because 12 hyper catalysts. But yeah, we're not done though quite yet because I still need to upgrade some of these minions, and we got quite a few Enchanted Eyes of Ender. I need to upgrade them all to tier 11 eventually, hopefully. I mean, I don't need to, but that would be nice. But currently, I'm just going to upgrade them to tier 10, so let's see how many I can upgrade. It is, let's see, the next tier, it is 96. So I'm going to get just around 10 of these upgraded, which is pretty nice. Still a long ways to go to getting them all to tier 11, though. There we are, all gone. But we still have 52 hyper catalysts in all of these. So don't worry, I'm sure we'll get some more. Maybe by the end of this, we'll have all of these to tier 11. We'll see. Uh, more visitors, more pets. I have to do this pretty often. I don't know how I feel about like extra stuff, like the bonus pet scan. Currently, I've been farming with no pest repellent, but also no bonus pest scan. So I have to do pests about every 20 minutes. Which, I mean, honestly, isn't that bad. But also, I kind of need more pests. I have a wheat spaceman, and pests are really good for wheat. So, I don't know, part of me wants to... Oh, oh, I just got a legendary rat. Oh. That's... Oh, wow. Okay. I'm gonna brag, I guess. I, I don't really know what to do with this, because I already have a rat pet. Like, but, like, I mean, I'll take it, I guess. <laughs> Not- Oh! Oh, a wriggling larva! What the- Why am I getting so lucky? What the- Dude, I'm getting RNG carried. I mean, I can't even eat any of these, because I already had, like, plenty. Like, what am I supposed to do with these extra drops, guys? I just want flies. I literally had no flies here, even though my thing is set to pretty fly. 
dude, I don't want rat pet and wriggling larva. I want tightly tight hay bale, dog. Oh, I hate it here. Uh, also, I screwed up and I'm not going to be able to get a gold in this contest. Or even flat or diamond. Ugh. Whatever, dog. Back to farming. I have not been doing nearly enough enchanting. I currently have like 500 million total enchanting XP or around 400 million overflow XP. But I have zero metaphysical serum. Let me just start doing this as I'm talking. But anyways, there's stranded players with like over a billion more enchanting XP than me. Which honestly, I have no excuse to have such low enchanting XP. I'm just really, really, really lazy. I need to get these serums. It will also make just enchanting easier in general. My excuse for not enchanting is um, um that I run out of Titanic experience bottle. Yeah, that. Surely. Anyways, I'm gonna finish doing these and then let's see if I actually get anything decent from this enchanting. <laughs> this is actually kind of annoying. I am only 32 levels off from enchanting, so it feels like a waste to be using a Titanic on this right now. I kind of wish that I was a lower level right now, you know? Also, I this might hurt some of you guys, but every single time I get Titanics, I upgrade all of them into Colossal just because, like, come on, I have 800,000 bits. Speaking of which, I have zero bits available. I need to buy more cookies. Wow, okay, let me find something to sell. Um, I definitely can't sell wheat because I have that spaceman right now. I don't know how many potatoes I need for composter. Eh, I don't mind farming more potatoes another time. I'll just sell some potatoes, whatever. It's no big deal if I need to farm more potatoes another time. I do not care, and... I don't know, I think I need like 50 mil in my bank, so I mean, I only have like 4 mil available, whatever, that's nothing. Hopefully I can buy a decent amount of cookies, they're 12 mil right now, I can buy like 5 of them, I guess. I'll probably have to sell more crops later because I go through 5 cookies worth of bits so fast, well, I mean, I obtain them. Obviously, I don't use them that quickly, but speaking of using them, now I need to waste them, because, uh, yeah, I like wasting bits, because it's funny. Anyways, uh, I need four of these right now, although hopefully I'll get more from when I actually do the enchant. There we go, and now I splash one. Now I have 580 levels, that feels so overkill, but yeah, let's hope I get something good. Oh, okay, I already got Titanic, okay. Surely I'll be able to get Titanic, that will make it- okay. I at least can do another enchanting thing worth. The worst situation for me is when you run out of Titanics, because then you have to like, get Lapis or get levels in another way and then hope you get more Titanics. It's just annoying in general. Also, I don't know if I should be going for XP, because I'm already like, enchanting 60 and stuff, but like... Honestly, at this point, when most of the things are uncovered already, eh, I don't really care enough. I doubt I'll find, like, any serums with, like, five things remaining. I'd rather take the extra 400,000 XP. Anyways, I won't bore you guys with this. Time to go do this a few more times. I'll let you guys know if I get anything decent. Well, I'm on my last super pairs of the day. I don't think I'm gonna get anything good. I don't know how rare these serums are, but... I don't know, I mean, I could still get something from this, you know? I mean, I guess I'll just prioritize the Titanics over XP and then Serums over Titanics. I don't know if I'll- I mean, I don't, I don't really plan on getting any books, you know? I don't really put that in- I don't put that into account with when I think about this kind of thing. But I mean, I guess if I got any good. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get any Serums. I'll just start carrying the XPs. PH. Yeah. Well. Back to farming, I guess. <laughs> All right, so I've been farming some carrot for a while and I just reached carrot milestone 43, which is pretty good. I might go craft some <laughs> enchanted golden carrots now. Let me just do my test real quick. But yeah, I'm only three milestones away, which is around 10 hours of farming. So I'll probably get this pretty soon. I have done a bit of wait for the skyblock, uh, these skyblock farmers little test event that's going on. Make sure you guys join that if you guys want to do any farming, by the way. That's a very good server that I recommend. Definitely not buy it. Modern. Anyways. Yeah, back to, uh, barn. And, uh, big surprise, I need to farm pumpkins. 
I'm gonna craft up some enchanted golden carrots and try to get some composter upgrades. I have been sitting here crafting carrots for so long, guys. One sec, let me put these diamonds in my head. But, um, I've been crafting carrots for a long time, and now if I just a carrot, and I go to the golden carrot, and I right click, max it out, as you can see, 1150. There we go. Boom. Plus 2.6 million carpet carpet 73. And, well, I already have a bunch of tightly tied hay bales, so let's. What love will I get from? Oh, when? I'm composting to get 9. I'm gonna have to go get. How far I get? There we go. I'm already at 19. And now I need fermento. So let me get some of those from back. I think I have some stuff. No way. And. I'll probably have to crap. Anyways, back to upgrading this. <laughs> Alright, and then I need four condensed fermentos, so I don't know if I... Yeah, I only have one. I have to go to my eye. So I find back on my back. I'm all my backpack. If I go over here, you see I have a ton of chests. I see a lot of my good stuff. Books. More books. <laughs> More books, more books. Oh, here's some. More than <laughs> Anyways, back to the barn. There we go. Now I am out of box at level 23. So I am two away. Pretty nice. I got a ton of skyblock. Wow. And I got a ton of up. Now I am at Skyblock level 2 weight with 56 XP. So I'm actually really close to number 7 Skyblock. Which is pretty nice, honestly. Anyways, I am so tired of farming and crafting and chanting and doing all that. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Subscribe for more content.